So he, he's a player that I remember back in Carolina when he was young at 18, 19, coming into the league. And I, I really liked what he did out there. And um, It's very difficult to have players pick eighth overall, walk away from your team, and that not hurt you. And we can't go out and get an eighth overall pick at that salary to come back who's got five years pro, but they just aren't out there. So I, I thought that that was a loss for our organization when, when, he, when he left. And he's a great player to have come back to us. And he's still young, so he's in the Shifley-Lowry mold of age. He fits right into that core group of players. The conversation I had was really about, I was doing a little legwork about the Winnipeg Jets. I'd been here for 35 games, but I wanted to find out how it happened, why he got to where he, he did. And then a lot of it, I think, was just timing. You know, the KHL was kind of ramping up into, they were adding the teams and they were spending an awful lot of money. And it's a, it, it can be a good option for a young player at that time. And I think things have changed as well over there. I also think in that meeting, um, he expressed to me an interest to come back into the NHL. He was respectful of the fact that he had another year left on his contract in Kazan and he was going to go back there. At no time did we ever discuss him leaving early. He couldn't. He didn't talk about that. But I left with the idea that his heart was in the NHL. And most importantly, um, you know, I asked the question how he felt about Winnipeg. And he said he absolutely loved it here. He really did. So. We get a good young player that we drafted very high. We invested in that player, a draft pick, and then two years' time and money. And we didn't see anything for it the last couple of years. And now it, it was very important that he comes back to our team.